Alright, what's up guys? It's Clash of Clans for the win. And I'm not only going to be making Clash of Clans videos, I'm also going to be making some other Android videos. Um, just here and there and just some other ones. So, this is how to bypass the 5 gigabyte uh, tethering limit or whatever limit you have. Uh, this is for T-Mobile. I'm pretty sure it works on other, um, on other carriers too. But yeah, I'm on T-Mobile on the Galaxy S5. So what you want to do is go ahead and go to the Play Store. Make sure you have like, I think it's like 250, um, like on a credit card or something. And then you're gonna want to put Wi-Fi Tether Router. And you're gonna hear, you're gonna see this one with the big green um, signal thing. And it's gonna say by Fabio Grasso, I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, so go ahead and install that and I've tried to get ones from like 4Shared and Black Mart and stuff and I'm just gonna recommend now don't get it from there because a lot of them are fake and I got one that was real but whenever I give off Wi-Fi it wouldn't actually show because I'm doing this to my Xbox and it wouldn't even show on my Xbox um, yeah so go ahead and buy that it's worth the money and if it doesn't work for your device you can get a refund I think it's like within a couple hours so go ahead and open that and you can see right here on the bottom I uh, total data sent plus received is almost one gig because I've been playing um I've been playing Call of Duty on my Xbox with it and it's been working like really good. I've always been host because my signal is always the best and um and I don't glitch out or I mean lag out or anything anymore. So yeah and you can see sent data, received data um for the last time I used it. Mm. So, I'm also going to be helping you with some things that you might, um, some things, some problems that you might have. So, if you're, so, say you give it off to, um, I don't know, like a laptop or an iPad or a phone or something. You give it off and it does connect, it does show and you connect, but the internet's not working. Um, if your phone gets LTE, try the LTE tether patch right there. And then if you have that on and... Uh, if you had it on when it didn't work then turn it off and if you had it off when it didn't work try to turn it on try doing that and then make sure you have the uh, advanced Wi-Fi settings make sure you put take this off always allow scanning and one more very important part um, is the APN settings you can take you can do it from your other settings or from here as you can see, I have this one. All you're gonna want to do is, since you can't edit these, as you can see, you're gonna want to create a new one. So all you can put whatever you want as a name. Um, I'll just put Wi-Fi. Um, for the APN, you want to put fast. Dot. T. Mobile. Dot com, and then make sure the I the APN protocol and the APN roaming protocol are both on IPv4. That's all you need to do. Make sure you don't have anything else set up or any of this stuff. Just leave it like that. Save it. And then I already have two as you can see, but I'm going to go ahead and switch to this one. And it's switching. That's why my internet cut off. And when I get LTE again, or very shortly, there it is. Now I can give off um, internet. And it works like really good. It's really worth the money um, that I paid for it. And hopefully it is for you too. So, yeah, um, if you have any questions, anything, because it may not work on some phones. Like most phones, I think it does. But for me, at first it didn't, and I had to reboot it. And after that, everything worked fine. So, yeah, um, just comment or message me with any questions you have, and I'll be glad to help. And, yeah, I could probably fix uh, your problems. Or you can go to question and answers right here at the bottom. But, yeah, so thanks for watching, guys. Enjoy this. Um, yeah, I'm just going to show you how to turn it on real quick. So, um, make sure your phone is rooted. Um, <laughs> I forgot to say that. I'm really sorry about that. But, yeah, make sure your phone is rooted. And if you don't know how but you're interested in, I could also make a video for you. So, if you want, you could tell me what phone you have and what what model, like what carrier, and also what the Android version is. And I could help you with that. Um so yeah, so you can see it's enabling Wi-Fi router. It takes about 20 seconds, but it's not that bad. See, there you go. And Wi-Fi tether router AP. And then the key is ABC12345, which you could change it if you want. But 
I left it at that. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys later.